Hi everyone, welcome to the channel. This is Cog Couple, and we're going to show you some Gears of War merchandise as always. Timmy's stealing an armor, so we've got to get him out of here first. One way. So, what we're going to show you, we've got some Gears of War for Cog tags. So, I nearly said Gears of War 4 there, but I've got to keep them around and stuff. These are Gears of War Cog tags, branded Gears of War, not Gears of War 4. I think the only thing that's Gears of War 4 at the moment is the lanyard. The cap, the t-shirts and these cock tags are actually branded as Gears of War. So that's not a problem. It's Microsoft owning the brand so they're starting to uh, pump it all out, get their money's worth in. So these cock tags are from Game. This tag's not on the in a sealed bag. But a lot of game stores are having them loose on the shelf which is a problem because we had to go through quite a few to find a pair that was in good condition. So. If you're going to go buy them from game, make sure you check them before you uh, take them to the till because a lot of them get scratched quite easily because they just sort of chuck them up on the rack and they get a bit damaged. So that being said, they're quite good quality for what they are. They're three pounds, four pounds. Don't quote me on that. I think they're four pound. But they're both both metal, quite strong metal as well. And not going to bend. The chain itself though is a little bit flimsy. Uh, it's not the best of quality chains, but then just the cost, I guess. It's just a simple little amazing, hard to find part when you look through the camera. There it is, there, look. So, yeah, it's just a simple like push through that bit there and pull it tight and it'll tighten up. Yeah, they're really nice cog tags. People have been sort of slating them, saying they're not really too keen on them. I mean, I don't, you know. I would never wear them out. Well, maybe on a night out, but I'm not going to tell anyone I've got them on. But they're they're really good details for what they are. I mean, they're laser etched on this side, nothing on that side, and then laser etched on this side, and nothing on that side. So the detail on them is 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 average. It's fair enough. You can see there scratches on them that they get. I mean, these have been these were in a packet. And then they've jingled and jangled around in my pocket. And they're already getting scuffed up and marked up. So they do get damaged. But I mean as a as an item piece just sit on your desk. They're, they're quite nice, like I say, they, they're nice and heavy, nice and weighty. Gears of War tag. I did find out on this last night. It's actually got some misprinting on it. Is this camera gonna pose? So any Gears of War nut should know that that shouldn't say that. But I messaged the guys and they said it's just an error. So they could be limited, they could be super rare. And this camera's not focused. There you go, stupid cameras. So they're the uh, ones that are out today. These next ones I'm going to show are the ones that come with the headshot drone in the Necker pack. I have to admit, I do prefer these ones over those. Microsoft branded ones uh, They just feel they just feel a little bit different like They feel more rugged. They feel worn. It's hard to say people who've got these will understand what I mean if you feel them against the other ones but Again, these are just I'd say these are more true to the game than the uh, Microsoft uh, ones but again, I mean these are Yeah, that designed a lot at a later date so they're not trying to just promote these are with these are with the um, headshot drone from the figures. So it's just like a collector's piece. The, the chain itself is a lot better on these, and it's got a much better bulldog clip on the on the lanyard. So that's not really gonna come apart. Nice and strong that one. But again, I don't, you don't wear these out. I mean, some people do. I've seen them doing it. It's cool. And each to their own. But I wouldn't wear them. But if you can pick them up at game. Go and get them before they sell out. So as with the Gears of War collectible stuff, it's just if you don't get it now, then you're never going to get it, and you're going to have to pay over the price for it. As I know, unfortunately. But yeah, I'd like to say thanks to everyone for watching these videos. It means a lot to me and my partner. You know, we we enjoy doing these videos. We love doing the videos. And it's nice to finally have all this collectible equipment and just show it off to everyone. You know. It's nice because it's like a lot of people are getting into the gears now and don't even know about half of the products. So we really appreciate it. And don't forget to sub and like and share the page. 
help us grow and we can keep continuing to show more Gears of War collectibles. Bye!